Welcome to iBoySoft channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to recover files from a Mac that is not booting up, especially from a Mac that has a T2 security chip. This is a T2 Encrypt MacBook Air released in 2018. It came with macOS 10.14 Mojave and was upgraded to macOS 11 Big Sur already. Check the about this Mac and go to system report, then controller or iBridge, depending on your Mac model. You will see the Apple T2 security chip here. I will show you the whole recovery process to restore Mac files from this T2 chip Mac. Before I start, I want to show you two pictures on the desktop folder to help you better understand the, re the recovery results later. Most times, people remember the file names or file extensions of the important files they want to recover. On newer MacBooks, when you open up the lid, the computer will turn on itself instead of pressing the power button. This computer is not booting up successfully to the desktop now, so I can't access any files on it. You need to boot the computer into Mac OS recovery first. Open the lid or turn on your computer. Press down Shift, Command, Option, and R keys together immediately. Hold until you see a spinning globe on the screen. Let go of the keys and wait for the Mac to boot. It may take a few minutes. In the Mac OS recovery mode, you will see the Mac OS utilities window. You can restore from Time Machine Backup if you have backed up the Mac before. A text tutorial can be found in video description. First, make sure your computer is connected to Wi-Fi. Then go to Utilities and Terminal. Type in the command as shown on the screen. If you prefer a text tutorial, a link is attached in the video description. The command may change with the software update, so please confirm the command first in the text tutorial. Hit Enter key to run the command. iBuySoft data recovery software will be launched through its server. It will take a few minutes to launch and you can check the progress here. After the software is successfully launched, all internal volumes will be listed on the screen with its names, free space, total capacity, and file systems. The volume which contains the Mac OS will be marked as encrypted APFS on a T2 chip Mac. You can double click a volume to scan or select it and click the scan button. It's recommended you keep deep scan ticked because you may want to find as many files as you can. Deep scan can take up hours to finish depending on the file size and use the space. You can pause, restart, or stop anytime. Usually hundreds of thousands of files will be found after deep scanning, but most of them are not so important. You can filter them through path, type, or time. I recommend you use the search box. Type in certain file names or file extensions to locate the wanted files fast. See what I'm doing here. A thumbnail will be shown at the right in recovery mode. I can preview a big picture. The software supports scanning any Mac volumes totally free. Then you can evaluate if the software is effective or your files are recoverable. You have to buy a license to activate the software for unbootable Mac data recovery. The rates are here. You need to provide a valid email address for receiving the license on another device like your smartphone. Then type in the key to activate it. I connect my Kingston USB flash drive to the Mac for storing the recovery files. Make sure your external desk has enough capacity for storing your Mac files. Do not 
save the recovered files to the Mac because later you will need to reinstall the Mac OS to make the Mac boot. I tick the box in front of the file I want to restore and click on Recover button. Select the Kingston disk as the destination. You can check the files on another computer and make sure you have recovered all important files. At last, you can go back to the macOS Utilities window and select the Reinstall macOS. After the macOS reinstallation is complete, your Mac should work again. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel or follow us on Facebook or Twitter. We'll have giveaways or discounts there once a while.